Hey guys, so I just want to show you this beautiful pattern that we're gonna make today um, and what a difference it makes for the different strings. So the one on my right is um, a five millimeter. Okay, and then this is with three millimeter single ply. So you can see the difference, but they're both so beautiful. I mean, you can use this for keychains, plant hangers, on layers of your wall hangings coming down. So anyways, let's get started. Hey guys, so for this tutorial, I just thought it would be easier to kind of tape it um, down onto a flat surface just to show you kind of how this works. A little bit easier than me holding up cords and blocking the camera too much from a dowel. So I've attached um, this berry color knot, these are both three millimeter, um, three mil millimeters single ply. I just taped it right down. I'm gonna keep these two completely straight to start. And with my white cord, I'm going to make a square knot. So I'm gonna go make this clear. Over top these two. With my right hand cord, I'm going to go over that one behind through the loop there we go and now I'll do the same from the right to finish the knot so over the red and now the left hand cord goes over the white one behind the red and through the loop that the square knot's done, I'm just gonna leave these two straight out to the side. And with these um, red ones, I'm gonna do Lark's Head Knot onto both of these. And how we're gonna do that is, for the first one, you place the red over top of the white, you pull it from behind and out, okay? I'm just gonna tighten it. And then for the second one, you go from behind, over top, and then you take it under that loop. Okay, so there's the first one. I'm gonna do it one more time over here. So to start, we go over, behind and through the loop, and we pull it. Next, I'm going to go behind, so it forms like that. I'm gonna take it over the red and down through this loop, okay? And then pull that. Now I'm gonna join these two together and I'm gonna space this out just a little bit. And I'm gonna do another square knot over top of those red ones, just like we did the, the first one there. There's the first complete one. You just want to continue this pattern and make it however long you want. I will say that these two working cords are going to use a lot more, almost double the amount of rope that the white one is. So if you're planning on making, you know, a strap to a purse or a bracelet, plant hanger, just um, plan for that and make this one nearly twice the length. 